Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm finally doing my gift guide that I said I would do since like the middle of November, but it's taken me forever to get everything I want on this list because I'm doing for girls and for guys and I'm doing a little technology section. So there's literally something for any type of person that you're looking to buy for stuff from $20 up to like $250. So whatever you're looking to spend, there is something on here that you can get someone that they will like. I promise you. So first we're going to start off with girls because I know most of my viewers are girls and even if these aren't necessarily things you're looking to buy for other people, this is almost just like a list of my favorite products because most of these products I have because I wouldn't want to recommend you buy something that I've never tried and I'll let you know if it's something I've never tried before I um tell you to go buy it for someone. But most of these things I have tried. So the first thing is a curling wand kit. I feel like this is a great gift because curling wands are like pretty much the only way people do their hair anymore. I feel like everyone's hair is always curled. So this curling wand is what I use and it's by Cortex and it comes in a set and you get four different size barrels. So this is a really great kit because you can get like huge waves or you can get really really tight ringlets if you want. I always use the second largest one which gets me these like medium sized waves. I believe this is around, I want to say it's 60 to $90. I'm not exactly sure. It'll be linked down below. Everything will be linked down below, but this is a great gift for a teenager, an adult, anyone. It's a good gift, but if you're looking to spend more money and you want to buy something a little bit more luxe or glamorous, the T3 curling wand kit, first of all, I don't have it, but I want it so bad so bad. I've wanted it for like years, but it's like $230, which is kind of outrageous. They have interchangeable wands just like this. You can buy wands that also have the clamp, so it's like a traditional curling iron, and then you can do just the wand. But they're white and rose gold, and they're just so pretty to look at. They're not just like a regular old hair accessory or hair curling... What is it called? A hair appliance? That seems not right but it's gorgeous so I'll have that link down below if you're looking to spend more money if you want it for yourself or you want it for a gift it's gorgeous the next thing is something I can't recommend enough and I have used these so many times I always get questions on this when I wear it and I always get questions in the vlogs so these are the Chloe Faye bag dupes from Amazon um, I have both of them well I have one linked below and then the colors you know are there's different colors, but I have the black and the brown. These are the perfect bags because inside they have different little slots and folders. And if you are buying for like a college student or a young adult, these are the best going out bags because they're tiny, first of all. They're not too expensive, they're around $50. So you're not bringing some like super expensive purse out to the bar, which you never want to do. It has this big compartment where you can put like your lip gloss, your foundation powder, your phone. It has a front slot, which is where I keep my cash if I have any cash. And then this little, oh, I have gum in there. <laughs> and I can just like fit the necessities in here and that's it. And it's perfect for going out. The black one I have used so many times. I wear it all the time when I go out, but you can't even tell. And it looks just like the Chloe bag. Seriously, exactly the same. The next thing is great if you are a parent and you're looking to buy for your child or you are, you know, you're just looking to buy for someone who wouldn't buy this for themselves. Because I know when I was younger, I never bought coats for myself. Like the last thing I wanted to spend my own money on was a jacket. But this jacket, if you watch my channel, you already know. This is the most comfortable and warm jacket I own next to my express one. My express one is also very warm, which I'll show you in a second, but I can't recommend this enough. As you know, I wear it almost every single day, super warm and it's fashionable. So you can wear your coat and you still look trendy. It's not like you're wearing one of those puffer coats. I mean, I'm just not a puffer coat kind of gal, but you're not wearing just something that's just so obviously not fashionable. Not that it even matters, you know, it's just a coat. But this will still, like, your outfit will still look amazing underneath this. I always wear it under and I have, like, a big scarf. It looks really pretty and it's super warm. And it's just, a lot of the times for Christmas when you're buying for someone, it's nice to buy them things they actually need that they wouldn't want to buy for themselves. 
like a coat. Who wants to spend their money on a coat? The other coat that I'm gonna recommend is from Express, which I've been wearing in all my vlogs recently. And I love it because the inside is leopard, which I think adds like a little pizzazz. And it's also detachable. You could wear the inside leopard as a vest. I don't think you'll ever find me wearing a leopard vest, but if you do, it has a hood and the hood has fur around it. It's just really cute, very warm. Again, a great coat that no one wants to spend their money on. The next two things are kind of like add-on things or, or something you could just give on your own, but I feel like I get a scarf for Christmas every single year and I always appreciate it because I'm definitely a scarf girl. So the first one is also from Express. I just got this kind of recently and the front side is like white leopard and then the back side is tan and white. So again, a scarf is just a great gift because it could be like an add-on addition. You're buying like a whole bunch of little things or if you get someone a gift card but you also want them to have something to open, a scarf is great because you don't need to know someone's size. You know, it's one size fits all for a scarf. But you guys also know I love my one from Nordstrom. I got this during the Nordstrom anniversary sale and I wear it all the time. I like it because it's black and brown. So if you're wearing more of like a brown outfit, you could wear it. But if you're wearing black, you can also wear it. This one is huge. I would say the Express one is actually bigger than the Nordstrom one, but both are very, very large and scarves are just great add-on gifts. Next up is some makeup. Makeup that I love, tested, tried, true, love it. If you're looking to spend a little more money, this Tartlet palette is great for someone who's who wears makeup and wears eyeshadow but isn't like testing things out and isn't doing all these crazy looks because all the shades in here are neutral and they're matte. Obviously, I really love this shade. I use this every single time I wear eyeshadow because I love this shade and I love this shade for the crease. I think this is a really great eyeshadow palette for everyone because it's all matte, it's all neutral. Again, you're not gonna create like the craziest look you've ever seen, but you can make a smoky eye or you can make a really nice daytime eye. If you're buying for someone who, first of all, is younger, I feel like the younger generation is very into YouTuber collaborations and stuff like that. The Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette is also one of my favorites because it has so many colors. And this is for someone who's definitely more into makeup, more into versatility and doing crazy things because like all these colors down here are kind of like out of the box. So I would really recommend this for someone, first of all, who's young because Morphe, Jaclyn Hill, James Charles, all those, I feel like young people are very, into that but also the color versatility is great and I believe this is around $30 you can get it at Ulta and it's just really pretty and I use it all the time because all of these shades are up my alley and if you're looking to spend a lot less money Bad Habit Beauty I love their stuff is amazing and their palettes are like 12 to $16 I believe this one is 12 or 14 this is the artistry palette and it looks just like the Anastasia what is that palette from Anastasia Soft Glam or something? But look at the packaging, like it's $12 or $14, but it's still really nice. It's not like one of those rinky dink palettes you see like at Walmart that's kind of like, ugh, it like doesn't look cute. Like this is very cute. I love the eyeshadows. I will say they have a lot of fallout, but if you tap off your brush or if you're using one of the shimmery shades and you wet your brush, they're completely fine. I wear them all the time. Could be a great stocking stuffer because it's very inexpensive and just go on bad habit they have so many, i have so many of their palettes but this isn't a video about all my bad habit palettes i love them and they're just great if you're not looking to spend a lot of money last two things are sunglasses at two different price points so i'm going to have them on the screen because both of mine of course are in my car the first ones are the key don't at me sunnies i love them and i really think they look great on every face shape because they're small following that like small eyeglass trend but they're not really tiny i hate the really tiny eyeglasses they're trendy they're cute they're black so they go with everything and they're around 60 dollars, so they're not super expensive but if you're looking for something more timeless and that everyone can wear i love the ray-ban aviators i've worn them since i was like 18 years old they're really cute. They give me such summer vibes. Like you can wear them with a ponytail and look cute on your face, but they're more expensive. I believe they're around 160. Next up is this thread and supply sweater. 
I think this is like probably one of my most asked about items. Whenever I wear it, I get so many questions. It's so comfortable and if you're really not sure what to buy someone, you don't want to buy them clothing because you don't really know about their style and you don't want to buy them makeup or perfume because you're not really sure. Something like this is perfect because who doesn't love a comfortable sweater just to wear at home, to throw on with leggings. With this, I would say size down because it does run pretty big. I'm pretty much a medium in everything and this is a small and it's still kind of big. But even if you buy it and it's oversized on them, it's still just like a lounge sweatshirt. So it doesn't matter. So I will have this exact one linked below at Nordstrom, but I'm also gonna have one from Express and Abercrombie linked below just because they're a little less expensive if you're not looking to spend like 50. This is on sale for 50 right now, but by the time you buy it, I'm not really sure what it'll be. It could be back to 70. Another thing that I think is a great add-on piece is this Hydro. It's a Hydra Peak water bottle. So it's not the Hydro Flask that's like $40. This is, I think, $20 on Amazon. It'll be linked below. I personally got mine at Home Goods, but Amazon is just the place to buy everything. I think this would be really great if you got this with like a gift card, something like that, because first of all, reusable water bottles are just the thing. No one's using plastic water bottles anymore, people. We're just not doing it. This keeps your water cold forever. I personally have the 40 ounce size because I drink a lot of water. It's cute, it's pink. I mean, it's just like a really cute little thing. And if you slap a gift card on here or a scarf or something like that, you just bought someone a really cute gift that they'll use. I hate buying gifts for people that I don't think they're gonna use. It's just like, you're spending like, let's say $50 on crap that they're never gonna use. They're gonna throw in their closet or they're gonna leave on their desk and they're just not gonna touch it. I like to buy things people need and they use. Water bottle, scarf, you're gonna use it. Another thing that I think is really great, especially for students, I know most people who watch me are students or are parents of students, is this day designer planner. This is more expensive, which is why I'm recommending it as a Christmas gift or a Hanukkah gift or any gift for whatever, but it's the best. I love this planner. At first I wasn't sure because it's like a day on a page and I wasn't sure if I would like having a full page for just one day, but I love it. And it comes in really nice packaging, like a box and a box. It's very sturdy, so you could wrap it up and it looks really cute. Now we're on to the technology section. First thing that I think is like gonna be the hottest gift of the year, if it wasn't the hottest gift last year, I don't really know, are AirPods. These things changed my life. That's dramatic, but I really like them because you can wear them. I mean, I've never had wireless headphones before, so these are like my first pair. But first of all, they just look, they look cool. There's nothing better than wearing these and you can just walk away from your phone, go clean, go wherever, and you can still hear your music. I just think that's so cool. For working out, they're great because you don't have that cord and they don't fall out of your ears. They are weighted, so they're not just gonna like fall out. And if you take one out, your music or whatever automatically pauses. But the other thing is that the holder is actually the charger. So once you're done listening, you put them back in here, they're charging while they're in here, while they're in your purse or your drawer, whatever. So you don't have to worry about them dying. And then when you wanna charge this thing, you just plug it into an iPhone charger. But if you're not looking to spend 150, I'm also gonna have like a knockoff AirPod linked below that has amazing reviews on Amazon. And if you're not looking to spend that much money, but you kind of want the same vibe, I'll have those linked below. Don't have them personally, but read the reviews. It has really good reviews on Amazon. Next thing are phone cases. Another thing that's a great stocking stuffer or an additional sort of add-on piece with the gift card, water bottle, scarf, whatever. I always get questions about where mine are from. All my phone cases are from burga.com. You've seen all of these. This one, this one is new actually. It's like really pretty, the same mosaic, but it's more pink. We have this marble pink one. This one is, oh, I showed this in a vlog the other day. This is also marble, but this is one of their protective ones. So it has a rubber thing inside and it's thicker. And I drop my phone all the time in this kind and it hasn't broken. Really, really cute and sturdy. And they're really just like the trendy little patterns. I have one on my phone right now that I've been using forever and it's the pink and gold marble. This is a pop socket from Like To Know It, but um, so I will have a link below to their website so you can just search all of them because there's so many. Next is a Fitbit. 
again, more of an expensive gift, but something everyone would use. I don't even work out and I use my Fitbit. This is a Fitbit Charge HR and it tracks your steps, your calories burned. If you want, if you're working out, you can like tell it that you're working out and I don't know why, but it like calculates the calories differently and it tracks your sleep. Next up is an Nespresso. I will have the picture of the one I have on the screen and I'll have them linked below. This is from definitely someone who's older, like you wouldn't buy an espresso for like a 16 year old, but if you're buying for like a couple that just got their first house or apartment or a college student, an espresso is amazing. I love it so much more than a Keurig. A Keurig, first of all, the coffee is like water. Nespresso coffee is real coffee and it's frothy and foamy and delicious and Whenever you order your Nespresso pods, they send you a bag so you put all the pods that you've used in there and you send it back to them and they recycle it, which I love. And the one that I'll link below comes with a milk frother and it actually makes espresso and coffee. So you can make lattes and cappuccinos or you could just make coffee. Next is something, one of those gifts that a lot of people don't want to buy for themselves but it's nice to receive and that's luggage. Who really wants to buy luggage for themselves? I don't know, but it's a great gift to receive because it's something you pretty much need. I mean, pretty much everyone is going to travel eventually, even if it's just overnight. So the luggage I use is from Away. This one is what's called the bigger carry-on. So it's still a carry-on, but it's bigger, but it still fits in the overhead compartments. And I just think, why would you get a smaller carry-on when you can get a bigger one, but it still fits? And the best part about away travel, which I think is like their huge selling point, is the charger. You can pop out and you can charge all your stuff in here. So when you're in the airport, you don't have to worry about finding an outlet and sitting next to the outlet for the entire time you're trying to charge your phone. You can charge your phone right here and walk around the airport. This way your phone won't die. So I actually got this one for Jesse because he was super jealous when I got mine and I have this in pink. So I got this for Jesse for Christmas. Figured black is a great universal color. Just to show you the pink one, this is actually the luggage one. So this isn't a carry-on size, but this is what the pink looks like. It's a really nice blush pink. I will have a link to Away Travel down below so you can search for yourself. They have carry-ons, bigger carry-ons, luggage, and they also have overnight bags, which I showed in a vlog before that I also got for Jesse because when we go away, like just a short trip, you don't necessarily need to bring luggage, but you need something that's more than just a backpack. And Jesse will literally shove everything he owns into a backpack and it drives me crazy. So this way he has an overnight bag and it's nylon. So if you spill anything or if your like hair gel explodes or something, you can wipe it off. So I'll have away travel, all that stuff linked down below. If you've made it this far, thank you. But my final category is stuff for guys. Guys are the hardest people to shop for. Shopping for Jesse, I think this is our eighth Christmas together. It gets increasingly harder every year, every birthday. It just gets harder and harder and harder. So we're gonna go with the obvious gift you'd get a man. Cologne, the easiest thing you can get a guy. These are the two I really like. This one is a Zaro. I don't know anything about cologne, but it smells good. It smells fresh. It's not too musky. And then this one is Aqua de Gio, which is like, I feel like everyone owns this, but this smells so good, so good. And what I do actually is I go to Ulta and I buy the travel size. I think this was like $40 or something. So you're not spending like $90 on a cologne because I don't know, that just seems crazy. $90 for a cologne. And like for a guy who doesn't wear it all the time, they don't need a huge one. Like Jesse only wears it like once a week maybe. I got Jesse this backpack off Amazon two Christmases ago and it looks just like the Herschel one, but I think it was $25. So it's actually what's called like a technology backpack because it's padded and it has a laptop. Um, I don't know, like a laptop pocket that you can put here. It's just a backpack. We're really not going to talk about it that much. It's nice and it's like 20 to $30 if you're not looking to spend a lot. Perfect. I will also have the Herschel one linked below if you're looking to spend a little more. I believe it's only like 50 to $60. It's not like they're that crazy expensive. So I'll have like the real one, the Herschel one linked below. Last two things, sunglasses. A great gift for a guy because a lot of guys wouldn't buy sunglasses for themselves, especially men who just aren't into fashion. Ray-Bans I think are great for guys because 
they have a lot of styles that aren't too like fashionable they still look good i'll have the ones that jesse has linked below because i think those are the best ones for guys they're really nice i've seen a million different guys wear them and they all seem to look good in them so i'll have those ones linked below i'll have a picture on the screen because jesse actually left his in california finally dollar shave club i think he got this for my dad for his birthday or something i personally don't use it but i've heard nothing but good things about it you can buy them a subscription for a year or for six months or whatever and apparently the razors are like really really nice quality and now i think they even do like aftershave and stuff like that so it's not just like you're getting razors anymore i think they send you some more stuff you get it once a month and you get replaceable razor heads so guys don't have to go to cvs or walmart or wherever and buy razors all the time and razors are like super expensive wow that was a lot of talking guys I don't know that I'm ever capable of doing this again because I'm surrounded by stuff right now, but that is it. I hope you guys found something in this video that you're going to buy for someone. I'm going to have everything linked below and I'm also going to have a corresponding blog post with pictures of everything and links and descriptions of each item. So if you're more into reading about this kind of stuff like I am, I personally like blog posts on this matter rather than videos. I can't believe, I feel like I just talked for an hour and that's it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed and found it useful. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Please subscribe if you aren't. And I'll see you again in the next video. Bye.